slightly unfair scoreline considering the two teams were very evenly matched. Yeah, disappointing, um, especially you know coming off the back of I think a five-game unbeaten run um, since Christmas. Um, you, you obviously want to keep. I actually thought we'd got the momentum to keep that up right until the end of the season. Um, I saw a difference in the in the guys pre Hartlepool um, game last weekend. Um, we've lost Joe Rowley, which is fantastic because he's gone to the first team, and I think that may have may have just um, we, we we lost a bit of uh, I would say um, that hard work ethic in midfield with Joe, and and the other ones would bounce off him. Um, I'm not saying that's the real reason, but it, it, sometimes it takes a player to leave, you know, the young squad to go further on in his career and and, and do very very well. As Joe has, and and we want a reaction from the others to think, well, yeah, I fancy a bit of that, and and, and continue playing well as we have done. And I said today, if I can count, maybe they had a couple of chances. Brad Jones didn't have a save to make um, the whole game. Uh, the one that he did make for a corner, I don't think he got near it, but they had one shot and scored, and you know we didn't even trouble their goalkeeper. First time in the world that Ricky's failed to score. What do you think was maybe lacking from his? Game today. Well, he didn't have any. <laughs>